Hello, my name is James Woody. I'm a product application specialist here at EpiRock, and today we're going to be going over how to check uh, proper motor rotation on your Dymex Smart 8 power pack. So at this point, we have power from the source hooked to the power pack. You can see that the indicator light is on, indicating the power is there, and the numbers up top also indicating power is there. You can see that the switch is in the tripped position. You turn that all the way off, and then all the way to the on position. Next, you can see the e-stop light is on. To clear this, you hold it for a couple seconds. It went off, that's what we want. If it does come back on, that means there's an e-stop situation that needs to be addressed. At this point, you can see the switch is on the power pack where it needs to be, so it can power the motor from here. This switch right here is motor on and motor off. When we go to bump the power, we will press the top motor on button just very quickly for just a second, and then you need to stop it by pressing the off button. When you do that, you'll want to see visually, check the sticker for electric motor rotation, and ensure that that matches which way the motor is actually rotating. So after bumping that and ensuring that the motor, the electric motor is spinning in the correct direction, if it's not spinning in the correct direction, please stop, contact your local certified electrician. And if you need further assistance, please contact your nearest EpiRock Service Center.